Hello, 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 and welcome to the Rangaroos Unit of the Reek. And today we are taking a look at United States Delta Force. So, in real life, a Delta Force, a United States Army only special forces unit. They are dealt to do hostage situations and counter terrorist actions, and they have been in many different engagements throughout their history since 1977 in Somalia, Iran, during the Gulf War. So, they've been all over the place. In game, he's a 25 point United States unit. They are 1979 year restricted, so it can be used in really any type of category deck. But their types are very broad for Marines, Airborne, Mechanized, Motorized, and so on. Take a look at his first weapon we have the Carbine M727, or an early version of the M4 with standard assault rifle range of 525 to ground and 525 to helicopters. They have a 60% accuracy because they're special forces with 30% stabilizers, so while they're running, they got 30% accuracy. Standard HE power of run, a decent suppression of 40, and a rate of fire of 300. 155 rounds a minute, which is quite fast for an assault rifle, thanks because they're special forces. Take a look at its second weapon, we have the M72 Law, and they have 10 of these rounds with a okay range of ground of 525, an accuracy of 30%, and only an AP power of 13. So they're not exactly the best rocket launcher these guys could be using. But it all makes up because they have 20 rounds a minute fire rate with this law. And well, normal special forces, they're like Carl Gustavs and Panzerfaust threes. They only get 10 rounds a minute, so you can fire off more of these rockets a lot more first to deal with lightly armoured transports and lightly armoured tanks. And lastly, we have the M60E3, their machine gun with a range of ground of 980 meters and helicopters of 595. So, very long range machine gun, and it's also CQC, so they can use it in close range engagements while static machine guns have like a minimum range of 100 meters. An accuracy of 30% and a stabilizer of 15, which isn't too bad. HE power of 0 0.5 and a rate of fire of 200 rounds a minute. So it's a pretty decent machine gun. Not the best, but not the worst. And if you take a look at its miscellaneous stats, no armor, they're infantry, they don't get armor. They only have 10 guys in the squad. They have medium optics, which is pretty standard for infantry special forces and a speed of 30 kilometers an hour. In battle, the Delta Force aren't exactly the most popular unit for a lot of NATO players. It's due to the fact of the M72 Law rocket launcher only have 30% accuracy and 13 armor penetration power. But if you use that rocket launcher as a tank stunner because it fires so fast and for taking out enemy APCs, it will absolutely wreck you. Thanks to its 20 rounds a minute fire rate. You can also get the Delta Force and some very nice cheap transports like the 10 point Humvee and V150 Commando. Or if you want something a bit bigger, you can get them in the Chinook or the Mini Chinook CH46 Prog. I just call it the Mini Chinook. But yeah, they're a very nice bang for your buck special forces unit. And if you use them as sort of just like sock infantry in a way, not so much as going behind enemy lines and kicking butt, they will absolutely destroy enemy infantry. And yeah, the Dota Force, I like them a lot. Nice, cheap, bang for your buck special forces. And once you realize that, they will become an absolutely useful tool in your deck. And well, that is all I have time for. This has been another Rangroos unit of the week. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.